what in the hell is this, bro? This is a sauna. Sauna. Bro, you look like Majin Buu. When Majin Buu was standing on the edge of this cliff, anything could have happened. There were seven guys inside of him at the time. Oh, my, my, my head is just outside enough for me to breathe because it's so hot in here. And then you will sweat. <laughs> Oh, daddy. Oh, daddy. oh, that's nasty. So your body will, will accept all of those toxins. <laughs> oh, God. That's nasty. I'm, t I'm sorry. Oh, God. I'm that's nasty. Your body gets steamed. It's good to wash the toxins of your body because even if I exercise, I couldn't sweat because it's so cold in here. So I need to have a sauna. I need to have something to to release my body with all of those toxins. Liar! Liar! You bro, must sweat a lot. Bro, this is what happens when Filipinos come to America. And then marry American people. They stop being commercialists just like we is. You done bought this damn big, this a big sweatsuit. You could have just wore a sweater. You done bought $10,000 worth of sauna equipment. Who the hell has this? All my uh, fellow Filipinos. Now this is my side. Listen, look, and listen, and learn. <laughs> Back in the Philippines, I just run, climb mountains, and I already sweat like crazy. They even, even I get out of the shower, I already sweat. Here in the U.S., I run, I really get into the treatment, I still didn't get sweat, and I need to sweat. Bro. Because it will wash the toxins of your body. Oh, that's nasty. As a Catholic woman, this is a sin in the Philippines. You don't buy no machine that costs $10,000 just to sweat. This is $10,000? You look at you, look. When they you see, said, you when, said that, that when you, they you, said, you, when... You don't order this, $10,000. Look at her, look at her, look at all, look at all, look at all, listen, bro. How you got all that over there? You still got your gym membership you don't use. You have a spa gym. You don't even use it. I, I told you, don't don't register. Register me in the gym because I don't you go could go. There. You could I go have tanning. A gym here. I told you, I already have a gym here. Why would you like register me to that? And now you have a sauna here. I just came downstairs and it's a whole sauna. I told you that I don't need to go to the gym because I have everything in here. But you still register me. See this and I don't like tanning because they're artificial and on your skin to get... I think this is artificial, this ain't it? This is not artificial, this is natural! How's it natural? Natural because is outside. It's natural steam! How, uh, uh, did, 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 did God give you that steam or is it uh, plugged in? Yeah, that, that's, that, that, that's from the God. The God teach you how to, be, to get an electricity. <laughs> <laughs> Liar! Liar! <laughs> to get the steam out. <laughs> it's, it's natural, Nagika, it's steam. And then I just put up my body. You see that body oval there? I brush my body with them over so that look at all her look at our slogans just five more minutes the only fear is no wi-fi look you don't you don't became bourgeoisie oh. are, are you bougie i heard this place is amazing mostly because look at all this fun stuff oh my gosh they have everything this is what i'm talking about the good stuff good good See nice like here sit hard you should like go in here but 24 karat gold cream i don't know i hope this goes on your neck i don't know pearl cream this looks boring you guys look at the snail cream do you see that i don't know about this what do you think guys do i look younger I don't know about that stuff. I'm cool. Make sure you watch that thing out too. Do you have to watch? You do not let them. I don't know. They're, they're just gonna be no, in this. Don't be in there coming watch. off. This is coming off. Man. They'll be coming off in there. Lord, this is smells so good because I put my body in oil. Well, I have a body oil. Uh, you know that. That is listen. That is not the case. The body oil, what body oil you go put yourself in there? That's yeah, it's very smells good. Like it's a body oil, so that your skin will be smooth. 
it will not get dry from from the toxins that wash out. You have to put your body and oil. That's witchcraft. I don't believe in that. Yeah, you don't believe in that. I don't believe in witchcraft. Because you don't believe in natural way of healing. You uh, no. Like medicine, you call for medicine. Every time. This woman is sitting here telling me that she's in a cocoon, concocted, plugged in. She's based in like a turkey. You are in there like a, a pheasant. You are in there like a small chicken. You gonna tell me about my eating Tylenol? When did you get this? When did you get this? You paid that in your Amazon. Oh wow! Oh wow! Oh wow! Oh wow! That's what happened if you give me access of everything, everything, card, everything. This is what happens when you bring your Filipina to America. Okay, ladies, are we all clear? Pretend to be caring, loving, loyal women, but only as long as it's absolutely necessary to get that ring on your finger. But Miss P, we really do love our husbands. Oh, come on. How can you love some dusty old reject? Ladies, you're losing frame. Your ultimate goal is to secure that green card and escape to the promised land. But Miss P, we like it here. No, you don't. How could you possibly like it here? You want to live in an advanced country where you won't be desperate and starving. But we're not starving. We're just not rich. Exactly. You're not rich. And how are you gonna get rich unless you monkey branch as often as possible? Keep talking like that. And the next thing you know, you'll end up cooking and cleaning. But that's what we like to do to show our love. Why do I even bother? You don't even seem concerned about the evils of systemic patriarchy or the damaging effects of gender inequality. If you don't stand up for yourselves, you're gonna end up with a house full of cats. I mean, kids. I mean, cats are much nicer anyway, and they don't cry all the time. Ladies? Where do you think you're going? I haven't dismissed you yet. Hey guys, I must say this. I hope you're enjoying this kiss that we're producing for you, but there is some stereotypes that can be harmful when you talk about Filipinas in the Philippine culture. Uh, yes, there's a lot of people who say that people come to the Philippines in order to be, uh, to see a better life and to improve themselves. But I must say that there's a lot of people that live in the Philippines that come from the Philippines or Southeast Asia or developing countries that have already done great things and are very accomplished and, and very smart and intelligent individuals take for a case my wife my wife is a, an accounting uh, executive for a company she uh, owns her own immigration company um I, I own some of it you know you know we're not gonna give her all that but she's been very accomplished she's put up and built from the ground multiple shakies restaurants she's been to 13 countries she has a master's degree and she helped put all of her siblings through college in which nine of them are college graduates so she's she comes from a very poor background but at the same time i think that she comes from a place where she's already done some great things and she really doesn't really need my money because she got her own money doesn't matter at all why i have my job I am independent. You want them because they are easy to manipulate. You know that they are willing to do whatever it takes to live the American dream and provide a better life for their families. Even if it means having to play the submissive role and having to sleep with your disgusting ass. Liar! Liar! Wow! Oh my god, you got it all wrong, man. You misinform I mean to the highest level. You have no idea of the true character of a Filipina or Asian woman is. By the way, for lunch, I'm going to make chicken thai for my passport king. <laughs> oh, passport king! <laughs>